Hello everyone, Chase here with another tutorial. And in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to fix camera missing in Device Manager on Windows 10. So let's go ahead and pop open the Device Manager by clicking the search bar and typing in Device Manager. There we go, I've got it already pulled up here. So here's our Device Manager window. And as you can see, there's no indication that a USB camera is plugged in. So what I'm first going to do is I'm first going to click Action. And we're going to scan for hardware changes just to make sure that it's not recognizing it um, from a USB port that uh, isn't working properly. Okay, so no success there. Um, what we can do if your camera came with a CD-ROM case, if it's a little bit older, you may have to manually install those drivers in order for it to be recognized. So let's go ahead and click Action. And let's add legacy hardware. This is the legacy hardware wizard. And in some cases, you may have an installation CD in which uh, it's recommended that you exit this wizard and just add the CD. But in just a case, you need to manually do this. This is the solution for you. So if you would like to search and install the hardware automatically, um, that's sort of what your computer does already on Windows 10. But if it's not showing up in this list, you can go ahead and select this bottom option, install the hardware that I manually select from a list. Let's click Next. In this case, we're going to add a camera. And if you have the disk already, or if it's a special USB, we're going to select the model here. This is just an example. Or you can select add disk. My computer does not have a hard disk or a floppy disk or a CD-ROM drive. So I'm gonna go ahead and click cancel. But this is exactly where you would do that. Let's go ahead and click cancel here. So this is where you would manually add your disk drivers for your USB camera. So let's go ahead and click cancel and I'll show you another way. We're gonna exit our device manager and we're going to go to the control panel and we're going to wanna to select underneath hardware and sound, add a device. This will give Windows another opportunity to try to find the USB camera. Now, if for some reason it is not showing up in this section here, mine is not, you'll give it a moment to think, but for some reason, if it's not showing up in here, there is another way. So let's go ahead and click cancel. And I'm gonna go ahead and close out of this window here. And we're gonna go back to our search bar And in the search bar, we're going to type camera settings. And this will pop up the camera privacy settings, which may be the reason why your camera cannot be discovered. So allowing apps to access your camera, um, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and have this one on. And that seemed to do the trick for me. Let's make sure that the camera access for this device is on. We can change this. All right, great, it's already on. Let's close out of here. And to double check that my camera is being recognized by Device Manager, let's go back to the Device Manager. And here we are. We've got our USB camera plugged in and ready to go. Windows will automatically update these drivers, but just in case you want to do that, you can do it right here. And that is how you fix camera missing in Device Manager on Windows 10. 